Hey everyone, this video will show you how to remove the Samsung retail demo loop that comes pre-installed when a phone is shipped from Samsung directly to the store and how to factory reset the phone after you remove it. This is a Samsung Galaxy Core Prime for Metro PCS. This tactic will only work with Metro PCS. I have not tried it with any other carrier, so I'm not sure, but give it a shot regardless and if it works, even better. So basically, this phone comes installed with a loop from Samsung that's meant to display all the features that come with the phone. Give it a second, the loop should kick in automatically so you can see what I'm referring to. So this is the loop. Basically what Samsung does, it is installs this loop and prevents you from restarting the phone, powering down the phone, and even if you go to try to do a factory reset, the settings prevent you from factory resetting it so that this loop is always installed. So here's how you're going to go about removing it. You're going to press the home key, you'll go into apps, you will find this icon right here, Samsung Retail Mode. Do not get that confused with this one over here, which is the Core Prime Demo. So we're gonna go back, we're gonna click on Samsung Retail Mode. If when you first boot this, a square comes up saying that it's updating or whatever the case may say, let it complete what it needs to do and then come back here. What you're gonna do is you're gonna click More, you're gonna click Store Settings, and you're gonna type in the password. The password is Nationwider, N-A-T-I-O-N, W D I D E R Nationwider. You'll press OK. It'll allow you to access this window. You will click on Disable Factory Reset. You will hit OK and it will start the uninstallation of the program. Now we're going to give it some time to do what it needs to do. If by chance the demo loop kicks in and takes over again, we would just repeat that process, put the password in, click on disable factory reset, and it continue the process of the uninstallation. Okay, we've reached this point, we will hit uninstall. Samsung retail mode has been uninstalled and you are brought back to the home screen. At this point, what you wanna do is you wanna power down the device. Let it shut off all the way. Now we're gonna factory reset the phone, take it all the way back to the original settings that usually come with the phone. You do this by pressing the volume up key, the home key, and the power button at the same time. Once you see the logo come up, as so, you will let go of all three. You will use the up and down arrow keys to select where you want to go. So we want to go to wipe data, factory reset. You will press the power button to confirm and you will go all the way down to yes. And you'll press the power button again. Okay, the process is completed. Now we will click the power button one more time to reboot the system. Now this initial boot could take a little bit longer than normal, and that's okay. If, it, if you see the Metro PCS screen and it gets stuck at it for a while, don't panic, just give it time. It'll boot up and take you to the main initial settings to configure your phone. But at this point, the process is pretty much done. If you have any questions, leave them in the comments, like the photo, and subscribe. Thank you.